Since it's April Fool's Day, I thought I'd share one of my favorite April Fool's jokes in history. In 1985, there's this writer, George Plimpton. You may remember him from his cameo in Good Will Hunting. How do you feel? You're gay. What, 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 what? Anyway, he published an article in Sports Illustrated about the Mets' new pitcher, Sid Finch, a yogi pitcher who had never played baseball, but through meditation, he could throw a 168-mile fastball, 65 miles an hour faster than anyone had thrown one before. So it's an obvious joke. Plus, the subhead of the article read, he's a pitcher, part yogi, and part recluse. Impressively liberated from our opulent lifestyle, Sid's deciding about yoga and his future in baseball. The first letters of these words spell out, Happy April Fool's Day. Despite these clues, Mets fans rejoiced at their new pitcher. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. The April Fool's joke on the Mets this year is that their new stadium, City Field, will be called Federal Bailout Field. Boom! Just slammed you, Mets. Although I probably will go check out a game this season because fuck the Yankees. Still I